back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Jeanette and I'm a fashion and lifestyle content creator here on YouTube. I've been content creating for about six years now and been on YouTube for about a year and a half. Anyway, um, I'll leave all my social media links down below like TikTok, Instagram and anything else. So feel free to come follow me and join in my journey for YouTube and don't forget to subscribe as well. Generally, I do reaction videos. I do reaction videos based on fashion. I have my own personal style as everyone else does. So I would like to at least um, give my kind of opinion um, and put it out there so do get yourself a cuppa I've got mine and um, let's get into it I'm reacting to a Balenciaga clone spring 2022 collection so I've reacted to many more below before so I'll link my playlist down below so feel free to check them out if you want to um, but yeah, I wanted to do this one because I'm a bit of a conspiracy theorist, I believe. I don't believe that there's clones out there, but hey, there's so many wild, wild thoughts and wild opinions out there. Anything can happen. So, yeah, get yourself comfy, grab your coffee, and let's get into it. We see our world uh, through a filter, perfect, polished, confirmed, photoshopped. We no longer decipher. Between unedited and altered, genuine and counterfeit, tangible and collectible, fact and fiction, fake and deep fake. Hmm. Who's got their tinfoil hat? <coughs> I must say that I've got a tinfoil hat. <laughs> Let's get into it. Oh my god. <laughs> That's crazy. Des yeux qui font baisser les miens, un rire qui se perce sur sa bouche. Okay, I love the monochrome. I'm gonna say it. I know a lot of people like black and white or just black. I do, and I love. I'm pretty neutral when it comes to things. I'm pretty much just wearing this denim jacket just because I've got a bit of a stain on my top. But otherwise, I'd be wearing it by itself. And I love black. I can't say anymore. I'm glad that my coffee today has got a black cup. I love black. Um, I'm from Melbourne. I mean, we can't expect any more than that. But yeah, I'm. Um, it's very dreary, like it's very conspiracy feels. I'm feeling the vibe here. <laughs> uh, oh my god, this is gonna be so fun. I hope you're ready. Does anyone remember that meme that is it Balenciaga or Prada or something? I said no no wearing this dress and then Balenciaga or Prada did this dress and it's like six hundred dollars. In that case, Balenciaga did a plastic bag and it just said Balenciaga. Who knows how much it costs? If it does, I'll if I find out I'll put it up on the screen and I'll let you go there. This is gonna be interesting. I've got to say, the shopping bags for Balenciaga, Chanel did that years ago, so maybe Chanel is a leading platform for me. Um, I personally find this is one of the reasons why I like it so much. Um, they thought of it, it was an initiative many years ago, if you remember they did that shopping centre style of the basket and everything and now they're doing it, so that was many years ago, five years ago at most, and yeah, so just interesting to see that. I know Chanel's not have to do with it, but they did that and they bring that out and they're, now they're coming in with it. I actually like that. 
with the belt and the like pet plum down the bottom. Some of the items I really do like. So, let's look, I might be getting my money in this one. <laughs> like Gucci that that is insane that's like literally just taking off the Gucci style putting on BB and this Balenciaga wow I mean, that's what that mean by fake and I'm you know what to make another point I'm liking that the fashion brands are now when it comes to things they're making more of a statement i.e. we're talking about clones and clones obviously is, a, is another version of the same but it's not the exact same so it's like a replica a replica of designer that could be um so i'm actually liking this i like a bit of meaning towards it not just here's some nice pretty dresses and there you go sometimes it's nice to you know feel that but at the same time it's nice to have a bit of meaning towards it Conspiracies in this. My 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 head's about to explode. Mmm. Is that the jewelry? That's really nice. This coffee's got like thirteen thousand beans in it.
conspiracy theory <laughs> I was feeling all that <laughs> I was like are they like channeling the aliens or are they yeah but anyway what do you guys think of the show I actually really like that something different you know like they need to bring something different in regards to the shows I feel like it's the same and sometimes when I do to push the boat I feel like it's not enough or it's too much like subtle bit by bit you know that's just me but anyway I actually enjoyed it. A lot of the collection was really nice. I really liked it. I liked that black dress with a bit of a frill. I liked that, I think it was a dress on a skirt. And they had a blue pet plum and nice belts. And noticed some of the bags were pretty much, I think that's what they meant by fake, like I said before, in another acting. Um, that's what they meant, you know, like, it's like, take off the Gucci or chuck on BB and there's Balenciaga. And that's what they meant clones and everything like that. If you're a conspiracy theorist, you know what I'm talking about. But yeah, that was really interesting to see that. I really enjoyed it. But I hope you did too. Don't forget to um, subscribe, like and comment. Let me know any, any of your thoughts. Put them in the comments below. If you have any you want me to react to, any fashion shows, anything like that, any other designers that I'm not really familiar with, let me know in the comments. Tell me which, give me your recommendations on how to do it. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye! I'll take off my hat.